I've already got a clear favor, obviously, so... So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball... Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? Go! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, needless to say, this lady was impressed. Uh, well played there, man, no? Wasn't Comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience <laughs> with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Yeah, let's check it out and find Comrade and so, the girl. How does it feel to soon I, be I known don't as understand her name. Julia That's Smith. the only thing. Really like her, but cheerful. It does have a nice ring, yeah. Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel. But now that I hear it, it does have a nice. I don't know. I don't think we need to make an so, argument about uh, last we names talk right about now. Plans, eventually. No, come on, let's plan together. You're speaking my language. I'm taking lessons. Yeah, I can't let's wait not for be us a to bitch. Plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. No. Of course, I you give me such a bitch yes, in this game. <laughs> I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. You aren't gonna have one, sweetheart. Let's just be cute. I love you, Alex. You know, I'm kind of like, if these characters are gonna die, they may as well have like the best couple days of their life beforehand. Where did everyone go? There was much celebration to be had. I'll go find them. You just relax. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Oh, sure. Jesus. <laughs> what are we gonna see here? Knew it. <laughs> Not even bother it, man. <laughs> Coast Guard! The Coast Guard are here! What? Everybody flush their meth! We gotta get rid of all this meth! We can't let them take us alive! What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I do Seriously, like her. You can't fuck around like that, Julia. Oh yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. Why do you have to do it in the cupboard like school kids? So. <laughs> All right. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Woo. I don't know. I don't really mind. So, that was... How's it feel to be a man we can have a bit of fun. I'm leaving, honestly. I've been carrying that around for a while. Can you, like, do something with that? I, I can't. There we go. Why'd you do it on the dot? I want it <laughs> to be memorable. It's not that memorable. That was not the smile she had, I want to point out. This is interesting, though. Hmm. I did do... I went scuba diving. Not not like this, but... I mean, in the ocean. I used, I'd done it in the pool when I was, like, ten. Just at the pool in our hotel when I was in Spain. And the guy thought I was so good at it that he decided to take so, me on a trip with my mother in the tomorrow? sea. So we ended up going to this coral reef and diving and I was too scared because people that were with us ended up seeing an octopus. And I so hate them. Awesome. And they're just scary. I hate sea creatures. It's fa They're fascinating. I like to learn about them, but that's about it. No other contact. Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Oh, no, not yet. I got distracted. Got it. What's under me? Off. Come here, you vixen. Vix? <laughs> Easy, right? Tiger. We should get back. Listen, I'm trying to make your relationship good, but it doesn't mean I right want here. to see all the sex scenes, okay? I really couldn't care less. <laughs> I 
You'll get no resistance <laughs> there. All right, everyone, check it out. Manchurian oh, gold. gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Let's what not. <laughs> Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. <sighs> wow. Do you find anything else? This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one mm. missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. I, I think they were respectful enough. I'm just gonna oh, say- come on. No one knows we've even been down there. And I don't think- Okay, so I agree talk. with her 99% of the time. You Americans are all the same, huh? No oh, respect that's... for anyone else's traditions. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. But as you long as we're not- You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like we a took one to thing back. The Here we go. Huh. We took one thing back. That. You never think about much of anything. It was well, a bullet. Maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Y yeah, I heard it. Okay, I'm pausing really quick because I just want to talk about this. Really quickly. So... I completely understand where she's coming from in terms of the respect. And if they were moving and shifting about dead bodies, like for example, that dead body that was holding the um, the picture, um, if they took that, that would be disrespectful. But they literally took a bullet hole out of the plane. That is it. Nothing else was taken. So I don't really see it as disrespectful in that place. They weren't kicking up a grave or, you know, taking something from one of the dead bodies or, you know, messing around too much. They literally just took a bullet that was actually lodged in metal. That's it. Story uh, happened right around here too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Sure. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up actually. Bring it. Scare away little bro. Okay. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? <laughs> Where'd you hear this? Ah, well, down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards, and for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. The oh, lighthouse wow. <laughs> stood atop an atoll, isolated. Did it give you a diet pill as well? <laughs> a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. Kari. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. <laughs> <laughs> he of the one track mind. <laughs> the woman answers I live here in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, That isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and insists her parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed down on the floor, is a yep. man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even <laughs> use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an axe. Right. She'd embellish the fact. You know, sometimes you have to embellish the facts a little to get at the deeper truth. It's okay. Okay, so who did it? So the woman, her? Uh, she's the still women? hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still oh. here in the closet. Ha, <laughs> the husband, eh? <laughs> so is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseats. <laughs> You're locked in. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet opens the door and sure enough there's a man inside but he's cut his own throat horrified he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark closer 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 and he sees jump scared it's his own <laughs> face and then its Ooh. eyes bulge out and screams <laughs> 
That didn't scare me. I'm sorry. That was cheap. Super twist. Nice. That nice one was quite a cheap wire. one, I have to admit. Didn't get me. Um, I wasn't really scary, but... You have me going. Pretty cool. Hit me on the cheese there, corn dog. Ooh, be okay. nice. You've all had your fun? We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required. One more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations <laughs> are these? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website <laughs> that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. 10-4, <laughs> good buddy. And I'm out. I am um, worried because <laughs> I'm starting to kind of like all of the characters. The only one that I'm like not endeared to at this point is C Comrade or whatever his name is. Conrad. Like I get really engrossed with characters really quick. <laughs> That's why I could never watch Game of Thrones. <laughs> Sorry, that was funny. I don't know why. <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. Jack Sparrow went downhill. Looks like a member of the KKK or something. <laughs> like... Well, the witch doctor is. <laughs> Fake out. <clears throat> what the hell? <laughs> Caught me off guard there. <gasps> Must be like a dream or something. This is a bit weird. Everyone looks so calm as well. <laughs> They're just so chill about it. Where's the other two? There we go. One down, one more to go. Knew it. Gonna be part of a ritual very soon. <laughs> ungog, ungog. I'm gonna. I'm sorry, I do trust her a little bit more than him. There we go. Ungag, of course, mm. you're not ready to have a merry conversation. You can talk and ungag at the same time, you know. Never thought I'd have to say that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come on, can we be a bit more urgent? Okay, now is the time where we can talk. You okay? I think so. Ooh. Hey! Hey! Damn it! Stop it! W okay. <laughs> Quick time. Okay. Button press it. No, okay. Don't even get a chance for that. What's she trying to do? Hey, so, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? <gasps> I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad good news. news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh, god damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. Where's the good, the good news? news? Uh, I recognize them. How is that good news? I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Hey. What are they gonna do to us? Probably know. kill you. Sacrifice you to Satan. Gonna get out of here. Make a potion out of your flesh. Investigate or untie. Untie. Untie, yes. definitely. We gotta get untied. Like now. I mean, there's no point in investigating if you're completely defenseless. Oh, shit. That's oh, not good. Come on. Wow. 
Wow, really? I'm trying to do the best with this. I'll be back for you later. Oh, the witch doctor. Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. <laughs> you're all alone with us now. What's Morgan Freeman Let's doing here? You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. Little lady. Are you serious? You got us into this mess, I know you're gonna give him cheek. There we go, thank you very much. I support that. Still support it. You know, three might be a bit overboard. Ah. Then, you know what, she lady? What do you? Let's, let's, we're not gonna. What do you fuckers want? Just get this kidnapping out of the way. Oh, I told you they wanted flash. So. Stop! Got to love a good flaying. Please, just stop. Slow down. Easy. No, of course they're not going to be an idiot. Just stop, man. It's What's antagonizing got to do? Sorry, I'm just curious. Impatient, reckless. Yep. <laughs> I love how they said um, <laughs> that Jessica was the relaxed one and then there's just him. <laughs> there we go. I saved you. Better start being nice now. Okay. Okay. Come on, okay. come on. I don't want you guys to die. We can do this. Julia, we're coming back. Get your hands behind your back. There we go. Right. And you get. It's okay. <laughs> We're gonna sort this out. I still don't know what they want, but it's fine. Oh Jesus, Conrad. <sighs> Thanks to me, wait, he made no. it back alive. Stop it, let her go! Oh yeah, just let out your cover there. Hey. Dipstick. Shut the fuck up. So my mom talks I don't to me. Think hit her. They haven't hit Fliss. Fliss sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with them. It's better to do so that bad. than get killed by them. Just myself. No, but I'm sure he's fine. We'll be. No, I didn't. I hope he's all right. Kids right. are the master of all this. I'm calling it now. Right. He took us to the boat on purpose. <laughs> your hands. Once we get Julia back, maybe we could take them by surprise. All right. Okay. They're coming. <clears throat> Thought he was gonna smile there. <laughs> like, not true. Why are they taking them out? I really want Fuck. to know. Motherfuckers. What did they do? Just take you out? Like, you see the rain? Hey. Bye-bye? Hey. Okay? What did they do to you? I'm fine. They didn't touch me. They asked about parents. What? How much money they have. Alex, I'm so sorry. What? What is it? They took my ring. <sighs> Julia, it's okay. It's okay. Plot twist. These are the bailiffs coming for the other girl. <laughs> They're getting desperate nowadays. They're just doing kidnappings instead of taking away possessions. So what happens when the shark <laughs> loan sharks this. come around. First they take on the hoose and schemes, then they take on the ocean. Yeah, I'm sure you're keeping everyone calm there. Ritualistically counting. Seconds. Storm's eight miles away. 
They came here on a boat. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. The main guy, yeah. He's got a gun. If we play our cards right, we can catch him by surprise. Take him out. How are we supposed to take him serious just sitting there in his underwear? Confident. No. If you can distract We're not gonna be idiots. We're I gonna play the smart. The, speedboat. the dude with a gun won't even realize until I'm long gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. It's too loud. They'll hear it. We're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I'll go through okay. the window and get the boat. You guys distract them. Conrad, just stay focused and get to the boat. Okay, let's do it. Okay, we're gonna do this, Conrad. Conrad and. <laughs> Two. Three. <gasps> I'm an idiot. I, I just done it because of this. Conrad, just get to the boat. I'm sorry. I'm such an idiot. I didn't mean to do that. I just seen it. I panicked. I thought it was like a quick time thing. Keep calm. It's hard controlling your own heart rate and controlling someone else's. No, go to the gate. I'm doing what they said. We're going and we're not letting anyone distract you know us. I've had enough. I want you off my boat right now. Get off my damn boat! She said, don't be distracted, just go for it. So I'm going for it. Oh, that was so close. The stress I am going through right now. You have no idea. Why are we just come on? Oh! I pressed it! What the hell? I literally pressed Y. We can't catch him with this old junker. Oh no. I already failed. I mean I didn't like him too much anyway. But it's more the fact that I've just died and I don't. <laughs> Take this. Use it if you have to. Mm, come on. Sit okay. down. Over there. You, right here. I didn't mean Sit. for him to just go. I thought now. they had a plan. Like, he was going to get to the boat, going to speed off, distract them, then I'll get in. Stop! Ferme la! I'd like to see a try. She hasn't even got cuffs on anymore. Uh huh. Olsen! Come here! Okay. Which one of you is gonna tell me about this Manchurian go? I am terrible. <laughs> oh, so I'm I'm silent just because I'm trying to like process everything. <laughs> He's okay. All right. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Me. Um. Oh, sorry. Um. We're only talking. There is no harm in just talking. You wanna talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna say it. Fliss has got to be in on this. She and these guys, they travel the in the same waters. She's the captain, and they barely laid a hand on her. I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. Alex, They're what the hell? You freak, you freak. I'm so mad. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna be distraught, but I'm so I mad inside. what I'm hearing. I just lost everything I have, and this is what you think? You're all in this together. This was a trap, and you set us up. Yeah, yeah, so. 
Put a cork in it. Oh, so, sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm really bad at this. This is the thing. I'm really bad at these sort of things. Okay. Come with me. Plus, I keep looking to my streamer as well, which doesn't help. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Will you try anything? Anything fishy. And there'll be consequences. Get it. Okay, I am not checking my stream. If everything goes bad, then I'm just gonna have to live with it. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Duke, we read you. Everything okay? Over. No, we're not going to ask for help. That's just uh, asking just for death. Any information about this storm you can give us? It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. Sound right. a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. No, we're not going to say anything. I'll tell you why. Yeah. Uh, I don't want her to die. <laughs> so. here. We can handle a couple buffs and drops of rain. Uh, See, I think I'm good info. at this stuff. We'll I'm just not good at the fast timing. Sure in a of days. But I think I know how to keep them alive, like roughly, in terms of dialogue. Question, can I like start this stuff over again? Because I'm like not happy with this sort of thing. Oh, okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. What's next? What's next? Oh, thank you, bro. Everything's better when we have each other around. Do you get that? Don't you? See? This is why we play nice. I'm just terrible at them. <laughs> That's how it works. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Girl, we are not dying. She can fix herself. She is under the boat. It's okay. Hey! Move it! Now! See, they're fine. Good job looking after number one. Real smooth. Great Could you bliss. not? Anyone know about Brad? Is he hiding okay, somewhere? Okay, me and him are I gonna have a bit of a problem. Good help. Okay, we're gonna be up to a Okay, this. keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. Can you stop Brad's shouting about it, maybe? It'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. Mm -hmm. Wow. That is my worst nightmare come true. I am terrified of shipwrecks. <laughs> I'm really excited about this. I'm terrified. That was not a good jump scare, I'm sorry. <laughs> Concentrating so much for like the quick, for the time responses thing. Like that's what I'm, I'm kind of scared. I don't need you to tell me I've done bad because I know I have, okay? Please, be nice. Well, you seem to have already suffered a casualty. That was a bold I'm not bothered move. about him. Not smart, but bold. What do you mean not smart? It wasn't going to help anyway. He was just going to go off and do his own thing.
Come on, tell my home, dude. Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? Cheers. Oh, hi. Um. Forewarned is forearmed. Yes. <laughs> okay then. We will turn to the Bard for inspiration. Shall we? Merchant of Venice, Act Two, Scene Seven. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, "All that glisters is not gold." Often have you heard that told. Most poetic. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I <laughs> presume you're eager yep. to get back to your story. But here's a thing. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. Ooh. Special feature a lot. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have said that. I take everything he says completely seriously because that little glimmer gold thing that tells me that um you know don't get distracted by these little sort of things and all that and you know everything's not as it seems so I'm getting a very I'm very cautious about that sort of thing and I, I don't think I make bad decisions as much I just think it's like the quick time events that I'm terrible Junior. <laughs> this is a good time to take them. One's in the boat, there's only two of them. One's got a gun, granted, but. <laughs> nice tattoo. Go. Us? Oh, okay. Sure. Oh, barefoot, poor thing. <laughs> kind of annoyed at Alex right now, not gonna lie. He's not in my good books. I'm so excited for this. I know I keep saying it like as if it hasn't like I haven't played it yet, but I mean this is like, starting to get right into the actual story. I mean, to be honest, I feel safer with a guy with a gun at this point. Even if he is kidnapping us. Julia just stopping for a little sit down. You'd listen to my buddies, honestly. <gasps> okay, fair enough. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> I know that I'm not a massive fan of the jump scare so far. Like there's been the one with the fish is the only one that's like got me really good. I'm trying to see what that is. Uh, the mask of madness. I did not sign up for a trip to Why did I say it that way? I have no idea. <laughs> Come on, go in the door. Go in the door, please. Thank you. See what I mean with the awkward camera angles? Ooh, cross. Um, I don't know if I'm going the right way. <laughs> okay, I am. I see people. Oh, hey, bro. I don't know. Who are you? You Olsen or Junior? I don't know. <laughs> oh, shit! Terrifying. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I literally have my volume up full and I just, I'm not, I don't know. 
Some of them seem quite a bit cheap to me. Orson, you're in Port DC. Okay, all of you, into the room. But does he have any clue what he's doing, or is he just like high right now, <laughs> just taking it as he goes along? Welcome to your new prison. <laughs> Aww. Oh. Thanks. I can find their way out. Oh, optimistic. I've done that one. <laughs> Probably the least important one in the entire game. is this fucking place? We're boarding. Is there if? If we're boarding. asked to have something to do with the Manchurian gold. We're not far from those coordinates. Maybe this is the ship that was carrying the gold. Guess it's a possibility. I'm more concerned about Brad right now, to be Can't honest. just sit around. We need a plan. Let's get back to our boat, get the hell away from here, and never step foot off dry land again. How's that for a plan? <laughs> That'd I be me. Goons take something out of the boat. Distributor cap makes the engine work. The Duke of Milan is a floating brick without it. We need to get it back. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. Just curious, that's all. Okay, so Alex is it like us? I mean, Conrad doesn't really matter at this point. Brad likes us, he's okay. Can you press on these? I'm just worried. I don't know, I just... I don't like a lot of them. <laughs> Not being funny. Speedboat. Proposal. The bends. So Alex to follow his gut. I wonder what else could have happened. So Alex... Okay, let's see. So Alex proposed to Julia. Julia said yes. They announced our engagement. Talked about it, they were both happy. And took her engagement ring. Okay. Bends. Decompress. That I th that has to be Chris, a good thing, right? <laughs> I just wanted to say that um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. You uh, think? Excuse me? I may have kind of... Kind of wrong. Really come to the conclusion that maybe, you know, you're working some kind of side deal with these guys. Just say whatever. sorry, okay? But I... <laughs> You I were mean, stressed. Obviously, that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us. So, yeah. Allow me to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, there I... we go. Thank you very much. Mm. Well, I forgive you. You were under stress. Accepted. Cool. Cool. Okay. We're all in this together. We can do it. Um. Let's see. I know this isn't gonna work. I'm just curious. Them two are gonna like turn on him. Him and the other one. Shot. <laughs> really? In this place you're worried about- I never get this, the whole character is pretty much thing. You're only supposed to rob them. Exactly. Thank you. Oh, but that's a bit extreme, don't you think? Right? I see something shining, hey. but I'm also aware of what he's saying. I just wish I knew what the fishermen were planning. I've never heard them talk. Let's be honest. 
Back on the Duke, I overheard them talking about the Manchurian gold. <laughs> I really don't think they had any of this planned until the gold caught their attention. We need to watch them closely. This could go from bad to worse if they don't find what they're looking for. Oh yeah. So, what do we do? Lovely. But, um, let's be lively. I don't. We need to either find let's not make promises I already do. We need to be ready to make a move when those fishermen come back. Okay. Well, we're not going to do anything from in here. We need to keep looking around and try to find a way out. I always love this mentality. Just this was him walking careful. down everything. We need to keep looking around. We need to find something. Sorry, that's my phone. We need to do this. We need to do that. And then they stand there. Look, he'll just stand there the whole time. And it's us walking around. They'll be like, did you find anything yet? Huh. Did you? Hey, look. Look at this. Hmm. Yeah, you just have a little look. We'll see what's over here. There we go. Give me a minute. Ooh. I wonder why they all left it behind. What'd you think? <sighs> Ganglan, Ling of <laughs> 1947. Archaeologists missing in Iraq. Um, 24 British archaeologists have been gone missing in the Zagros Mountains of Iraq. The Hogson expedition arrived in the kingdom in September last year. The stated goal of unearthing the... Okay. Iron gold, perhaps? Stripped. Not gonna work that way. Talk to Julia. Let's be nice. Think Come this ship was? Never mind. <laughs> Get to you in a second. Miss J. Rivera, apartment 2275 Lockwood Drive, Crescent Springs, Kentucky. <laughs> oh, this is. Oh, what they used to call them. I'm really scared. There was like a name that people in World War II used to call them. Um, it was like a sugar note, or, uh, I don't remember, but when they had like letters to their wives or girlfriends. Hi, baby doll, I miss you like crazy. Three months until my next leave and jumping into your arms. Three months. I've been on some shore leave with the guys. I've had a few beers, but don't worry. I've been keeping everything ready for you if you catch my drift. How's work? I hope that boss of yours is leaving you alone. I know you can take care of yourself, but I feel helpless being away so far, and I want to keep you safe. Too bad you're dead. I mean, it's kind of a downer. Can we talk to her? No? Okay, fine. I just wanted to be nice and make friends. Asa. It's a dog. I like dogs. They're so cute. <laughs> okay. Okay. So let's see what's over here. This is what is that? Very oh, strange. Okay. It's just glasses. I don't see how it's that strange. <laughs> Like, I'm wearing glasses right now, it's not that strange. It's just, I can see light coming from here, so that's why I'm going towards it. <laughs> okay, so that's what not gonna think? work. I can't get it open. Over here. Maybe we can bend it open and get out of here. This is the way out. You want me to just smash through this wall? Huh. Oh yeah, sure. Big man on campus. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Wait, wait. Maybe we should try barricading the door instead. Can I get some help with this? 